in the dimly lit basement of an old, abandoned house. A group of aspiring YouTubers gathered around a worn wooden table. Their cameras were set up, and excitement filled the air as they prepared to conduct a Ouija board seance, hoping to capture paranormal activity for their channel. Leading the group was Lisa, the fearless and charismatic host of the channel. Alongside her were her friends, Michael, the tech-savvy camera operator, Sarah, the skeptic, and James, the adventurous thrill-seeker. Together, they believed they were about to capture the most extraordinary content yet. With trembling hands, they placed their fingertips on the planchette, their fingers barely touching. They began to ask questions, hoping for any sign of communication from the spirit world. Minutes passed with no response, and the atmosphere grew tense. Just as they were about to give up, the planchette moved slowly, spelling out the word abacus. The group exchanged bewildered glances. None of them had heard of such a name before. The planchette continued to spell out cryptic messages, revealing a malevolent presence that called itself abacus. Laughter turned into fear as the room grew unbearably cold. The lights flickered, casting eerie shadows across the basement walls. Sarah, the skeptic, began to panic, her skepticism giving way to terror. As the seance escalated, a sudden burst of supernatural energy enveloped the room. The planchette rocketed across the board, knocking over candles and shattering glass. A sinister force descended upon them, and Michael, the camera operator, fell into a trance. His eyes turned a sickly shade of yellow, and a guttural voice emerged from his mouth, a voice that was not his own. It spoke in riddles and threats, revealing itself as Abacus, a demon of great malevolence. Terrified and unable to help their possessed friend, Lisa and Sarah made a frantic call to Lisa's uncle, Father Samuel, who had been both a priest and an exorcist. He had dealt with the supernatural before, and they hoped he could save Michael from the grip of this malevolent entity. Father Samuel arrived at the abandoned house with a sense of dread. He had seen true evil in his years as an exorcist, and Abacus was a name he knew all too well. Armed with his faith and holy artifacts, he entered the basement, where Michael, now fully possessed, writhed and convulsed. The exorcism was a harrowing ordeal, lasting hours as Father Samuel battled Abacus for control of Michael's soul. The room was filled with sinister laughter and vile threats, but Father Samuel's unwavering faith proved stronger. With a final prayer and a burst of blinding light, Abacus was expelled from Michael's body, leaving him weak and shaken. The demon vanished, cursing the group with its promise to return. The YouTubers had captured paranormal activity, but they had also unwittingly unleashed a malevolent demon. They quickly abandoned their channel, haunted by the horrors they had witnessed. As for Father Samuel, he knew that the battle against the forces of darkness was far from over. Abacus was a demon with a long memory, and it was only a matter of time before it sought revenge. The shadows had deepened, and the war against the supernatural continued, a battle that would never truly end.